Glory be to God. I welcome you to this edition of Apostolic Fire Prayers. In this episode, we are going to be dealing with divine security. God is our defense. And we are going to read the word of God in Psalm 62, verse number 2. He only is my rock and my salvation. He is my defense. I shall not be greatly moved. I want to ask you a question. Who is your defense? Who are you trusting in? Who do you believe to protect you? Because as you know, we live in the world of powers. Whether we like it or not. Somebody said, well, I am not a Pentecostal fellow and I don't believe in spiritual warfare. The thing is that you don't just have to believe, but what exists, exists. For the fact that you've not been to other planets to really confirm if they really exist does not change anything. They are there. There are proofs. Somebody said, well, uh, I don't believe in witchcraft because I believe nobody can do me witchcraft. I don't know anything about witchcraft, so nobody can do me witchcraft. Well, that is just ignorance. For the fact that you don't believe they exist does not change anything. Because what is there is there. And what you don't know, you don't know. What you don't know is above you, except when you seek knowledge. The Bible says, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Not academic knowledge. Some people are professors. Some people have academic qualification. Very high profile, educated, you know, individuals. But they may be completely ignorant when it comes to spiritual issues. And so, what we know, we know. We speak from experience. We speak from what the Holy Spirit have taught us. We speak from revelation. We speak from vision. We speak from trance. As the Holy Ghost makes these things possible. We teach, we preach, and we pray with results. Glory to God. He is my rock and my salvation. He is my defense. A lot of people trust in many things. Some trust in witch doctors. Some trust in black magic. Some trust in occult practice. The Lord is my defense. You who believe in God, you must know that your God is ready to secure you 24-7. He has promised that. And he is a keeper of covenants. He doesn't change. He doesn't sleep. He doesn't slumber. So you can trust in him. Some people have kept some things they call backups. But you know, except the Lord guides a house, the watcher, the watchman, they watch in vain. He is God who declares the end from the beginning. Nothing is hidden for him. Night and day, they are all the same for him. Light and darkness, no difference. He can put his hand in the bottom of the sea, no matter the depth, and get there. He occupies the universe. He occupies every space you can think about. His name is the Most High God. I am your defense. And the enemy sometimes will try to fight and say our God cannot do anything. But I tell you, our God can do everything. Our God can do everything. I tell you, our God can do everything. And that is a prayer I want us to pray now so that you can secure your place under his wing. When he sprays his wings, you hide there. His name is Jehovah. El Shaddai. I am that I am. He never changes. He never fails. The almighty God. 
Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You can depend on him. You can trust him. He doesn't fail. He doesn't change. The same yesterday, today, and forever. There are lots of people who cannot sleep in the night. Because one entity or the other is bouncing them on the left, bouncing them on the right, doing them all kinds of mischief. Some people, they work in an environment that is very hostile. They work with individuals who believe in so many other things. They believe in so many other things. They don't believe in the God we believe in. But should that make you live in fear? No, you don't have to live in fear. Just know the God who is your defense. I once visited a fellow and I was going to pass a night with their family, you know, some, some years back. And uh, I left my shoes outside because I don't want to dirty their sitting room. All right. And uh, in the night, I saw them moving the shoes at the door with speed. And I said, why are you doing that? They said, don't you know, entities will come and wear them. Evil spirits will come and wear them or put something inside. I said, entity can wear your shoes. I said, wow, I'm interested in that. Leave that shoe outside. You can take all yours inside. Leave mine outside. Let me see the entity that will come and wear them. The problem we have in the body of Christ is that some of us have not prayed to the level where we can experience the dynamics of God's fire. Remember the God we are talking about is God who answers by fire. Elijah said, the God who answers by fire, let him be God. And the fire fell and consumed the stones. Consumed. It consumed the wood. Lit up the water. Lit up the sacrifice. The fire of God is consuming fire. Our God is a consuming fire. He speaks from fire. He is represented by fire. When he wrote the Ten Commandments, it was with the finger of fire. He is my defense. He is your defense. You can trust in him. You can believe in him. A lot of believers live in fear. Fear of the unknown. They don't know what tomorrow brings. They don't know what will happen the next hour. They don't know what is going to happen to their children or their future. You don't need to bother about all these things. So far as he is the captain of your life, as he is the pilot of your life, don't bother about what tomorrow brings. Just do your best and leave the rest to him. He is God. He will take care of all that. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is nothing that is impossible for him. With God, all things are possible. Have you been attacked by forces of darkness? Just call on him. He is your defense. Are you afraid that somebody might throw some black magic and witch doctor something on you? You don't need to do that. Believe in the God who is your defense. When a little boy is working with his big daddy, big muscular daddy, of course, he can turn to the other little chap there and pinch him and watch the boy react. When the boy looks at the big daddy, he will not react. But if he's alone, he will react. That big daddy, God, is with you. He is surrounding you. He said, as the mountains are round about Jerusalem, so he's round about you. Hallelujah. And so, we are going to pray. And establish this particular uh, uh, scripture. He is my defense. He is your defense. Hallelujah. Believe in him. In the morning, believe in him. In the afternoon, trust in him. In the night, trust in him. With him, all things are possible. Glory to God. I want us to go before the Lord in prayer. Say, my father, my father, my father. I trust in you. I believe in you. 
Increase my faith to believe that you can do everything for me. Increase my faith to believe that you are really my defense. Increase my faith in the name of Jesus. Increase my faith. In the name of Jesus, increase my faith. In the name of Jesus, increase my faith. Increase my faith. In the name of Jesus, increase my faith. In the name of Jesus, increase my faith. My father, my father, my father, increase my faith. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Say, who are you entities challenging my trust in God? Who are you entities challenging my trust in God? In the name of Jesus, catch fire right now. Somersault, catch fire. Somersault, catch fire. Somersault, catch fire. Somersault, catch fire. In the name of Jesus, somersault, catch fire. Somersault, catch fire. Somersault, catch fire. Now, Barre Gadodo escape Parima Antaya. Now, Bracoto Gazogotoy. Now, Bobo and Poromo Kadiskra. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Say powers challenging my God. My God is my defense. I am that I am is my defense. I come in the name of my God. And I command every altar every temple that is waging war against me you say that the way i'm saying it every temple every evil altar every evil machinery waging war against me as i jam my hand together burn to ashes one two three go now go now go now evil altar go go evil altar Evil altar, bomb now, bomb now, bomb now, bomb. Born in the name of Jesus. Evil altars, evil shrines, evil temple, waging war against me. In the name of Jesus, cut fire right now, cut fire right now, cut fire right now, bomb, 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 bomb. Born in the name of Jesus. We command in the name of Jesus. Evil altars, evil shrines. Waging war against my life. You say it exactly the way I'm saying it. Evil altars. Evil shrine. Black magic temples. In the name of Jesus. Occult temples. Occult altars. Waging war against me. In the name of Jesus. Bomb now. Bomb now. Cut fire. Bomb. Cut fire. Bomb. Cut fire. Bomb. Cut fire. Bomb. Cut fire. Born in the name of Jesus. Kaparabaga deseketerebash. In Jesus' name we pray. Yes. Pray very well. Pray very well. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. I know somebody is praying this prayer. Pray very well. Say, oh God, my father. You are my defense. Defend me. Defend me. Defend me. Defend me in the morning. Defend me in the afternoon. Defend me in the night. Defend me, oh God. Defend me. Oh my father. Defend me. Oh my father. Defend me. Defend me from the onslaught of darkness. Defend me from workers of iniquity. Defend me, oh God. Don't put me to shame. Defend me. You are my God. Defend me. You are my God. Defend me. You are my God. Defend me. Malaga dosiko. I break up popo popo. Ragadatata. Defend me, oh my Father. Defend me. You are my God. Defend me. You are my God. Defend me. You are my God. Defend me in the name of Jesus. Gabora Bokatozia. Na ba ba ba. Defend me. You are my God. 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 Defend me in the name of Jesus. Amen. You see some of you that are in some critical work situation. Sometimes they set traps for you. So you can get into trouble. They set traps for you. Even some of you who are preachers. The enemy set traps for you. So you can fall into sin. And then they'll bring scandal upon you. And bring all kinds of things into your ministry. 
If you are a minister, you are an evangelist, you are a pastor, you are a bishop, archbishop, apostle, whatever portfolio you maintain in the body of Christ, pray this prayer very well. Because I sense in my spirit, the enemy planning against some ministers to bring scandal your way so they can diminish what God is doing in your life. You pray this prayer and pray it well. Say, agents of the marine kingdom, agents of witchcraft, agents of powers of darkness, plotting traps for me, planning and projecting traps for me to catch me, to put me in trouble and put me in problems. Say in the name of Jesus, as I jam my hand together, whatever the trap they are setting, whatever strategy they are applying, as I jam my hand together, let mighty fire move ahead and stop them and burn the traps. Are you ready for that prayer? One, two, go. Burn, burn. Evil trap, burn down. Evil trap, burn, burn, burn. Evil trap, burn. Evil trap, but evil trap, but evil trap, but but right up, 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 but 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 evil trap, but but right up, but la bagato zico paradash and the gado do capa evil traps, evil traps, evil traps. Evil pits, dog for me in the name of Jesus. Bah, 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 right, bah, right, bah, right, burn in the name of Jesus. Every pit from the marine kingdom, every pit from the witchcraft kingdom, every trap, spiritual traps set for your feet, spiritual traps set to capture you, spiritual traps set to arrest you, spiritual traps. Set to put you in a demonic pit in the name of Jesus. We destroy those pits. We destroy the traps. We burn them up. Right now. Burn. Right Burn. Burn in the name of Jesus. Yes. The Lord is your defense. What will he defend you from? He will defend you from arrows of sicknesses and diseases. Yes, yeah, somebody sent me a message yesterday. He said, the, the, the monkey, is it monkey pox or monkey something is in town. The enemy does not want people to live in peace. They sent the pandemic. Now the pandemic is gone down. They are now bringing monkey pox. Tomorrow they will bring pig pox. They will, they will bring chicken pox. That one has been there. Or they will bring mice or rat pox. They keep introducing new things. But the fire of God will burn them up. Yes. 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 Say every arrow of sicknesses and diseases. Fired into my body. Pray this prayer very well. Eh? Every arrow of sicknesses and diseases fired into my body. Hey, as I jam my hand together, evil arrow, remember God is your defense. He would defend you from evil sickness. He would defend you from evil disease. Yes. Evil sicknesses and evil diseases. As I jam my hand together, born out of my system, and don't even come near me. Burn out of my system. Wherever that evil disease is, God will defend you from that evil disease. He is my defense. Psalm 62 verse 2. He is my defense. The Lord is my rock. He is my defense. When you wake up in the morning, you say that. Say, oh God, you are my defense. In the course of the day, you say to yourself so many times. Oh God, you are my defense. Defend me. He's going to defend you from that sickness and disease. Are you ready? 
Say evil arrow of sicknesses and diseases launched into my system. As I jam my hand together, burn and disappear. What? Yes, let it defend you from those arrows of sickness, those arrows of diseases. Let it defend you. Na bakote go boko rondeshka papa in class. Pragato ziko pa intalia. Taka popo inko. Pariga bakre maku dizoko. Tabarika ta 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 ta. In Jesus now we pray. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Let me pray for you. Let me pray for you. Place your two hands on your head. In the name of Jesus of Nazareth, the anointed one, the Christ, I come as a servant. I stand on the altar of my calling and I issue a word of decree and pass a word of power to the entities that are after you and fighting you and giving you sleepless nights and giving you depression. The Lord is your defense. I come in the name of Yeshua of Nazareth, Jesus Christ, the anointed one. The Bible says God gave him a name above every name. That at the mention of his name, every knee shall bow. That God shall defend you. In the name of Jesus, I speak against the unending battles. You are being faced with from entities and their human agents. God of defense is coming your way. Help is coming. David said, I look unto the hills from where comes my help. Help is coming from your daskata. Help is coming from the chief defender. Help is coming. From the general in charge of defense. Help is coming. From that mighty gigantic God. That occupies the breath and wit and light of the universe. In the name of our God. In the name of Jesus. I speak the word of power. Upon your life. And I command. Every arrow. Deadly arrow. Of sicknesses. Diseases. Attack. In the name of Jesus, God will save you. Le garoka popo gadeaska. God will deliver you. God will set you free. Every chain that is holding you, let God defend you from spiritual chains. Defend you from satanic chains. Defend you from traps. Defend you in the name of Jesus. Oh God, arise. Defend your people from bankruptcy. Somebody is trying to get bankrupt. Somebody is getting out of cash. I speak by the word of power. Let him save your business. Let him save your finance. That marriage that is on rocks right now. I speak the word of life into that marriage. Let it pick up again. 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 Let life pick up again. 
that home that has gone dry, that home that is on rocks right now, I command in the name of Jesus, that God that is your defense, let him defend your home. Let him defend your home. Let him defend your home. That, yeah, that chap that the, the medical people have told you, you just have a few months to leave. The God I'm talking about will defend you. Let him 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 defend you in the name of Jesus. You are blessed with the blessings of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Thank you, mighty Father. Glory to your name. Hallelujah. 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we pray with thanksgiving. Amen, amen, and amen. Once again, this is your own brother, Apostle Dr. Oche Ambrose Emerson. Uh, doing this uh, apostolic fire prayers. You can contact me. I have outreaches all around Trinidad and Tobago. And uh, in Tobago, we are in Bon Accord. All right. After the penny savers, you get to the junction where the school is. If you're coming from Lowlands, at the traffic light, you go left and drive. Up street, there's a hardware on that street. Before you get to the hardware, you see us on the left. You will see the banners, the flyer, and everything there, indicating there's a meeting going on there. Or you will see the signboard is rent a car. A car renting company had been using that yard. So you will see a chapel there. So we meet bi weekly. Because if I'm not in Tobago, then I will be in Trinidad that week. So you can contact me on 335-9049. The prayer line is open and God can do something in your life. He is your defense. Amen. And in Trinidad, uh, you can also contact me in Davis Street. Davis Street uh, off Cleaver Road. The last upstairs and downstairs house on David Street on the right. We meet there as well. If we're not there, we'll be at around west. All right, at Abdul Ghani Street, at uh, around west in San Juan. It's easy to get to Abdul Ghani. Once you are at the Kise in San Juan, you just look for where the around west taxi is and you pick it straight. Tell them you're going to Abdul Ghani Street and they will drop you right there. Okay, sometimes we are in San Grande, sometimes we are in San Fernando, uh, right? Uh, sometimes in Diego Martins. So we have outreaches all over the places. Okay, and uh, uh, very soon we will spread to Princess Town, we will spread to Point 14, and all over the land with the prayer fire. Be part of it. All right. Be part of it. It's a non-denominational outreach. You can come from everywhere and come and pray. All right? Nobody is holding you down. You can go to your church or your fellowship, but come, let's pray. Let's pray together. All right? In heaven, there is no name of any church. All God is interested in is the blood washed. Those prepared for heaven. And I know that God will prepare you for heaven. That is the most important thing. All right. The Lord bless you mightily. Once again, 335-9049. You can reach me. God bless you. Till I come your way again next week, have a wonderful, wonderful day ahead of you. I am Apostle Dr. Oche Ambrose Emerson of Apostolic Fire Outreaches. I'm inviting you to tune in to the Tobago Inspirational Network for apostolic fire prayers every Wednesday at 6 p.m. It's a time of healing. It's a time of deliverance. It's a time of warfare prayers.